Welcome to the Retreat Leaders Podcast. This is Shannon. All right. If you have been listening to this podcast for a hot minute, you probably have seen some changes. Even if you've only listened to like one other show, you probably have noticed that the title is different. (laughs) So I thought I'd take a minute real quick and just kind of, I don't know, share with you what I'm going through and what the podcast is going through. So history lesson here. The podcast is, oh gosh, I think it's about four years old. And it was started with my really good friend, Dee. We would have these amazing conversations. Uh, I just loved talking to her. We would just get deep into stuff that's like, I don't know, you guys, life, right? And so I thought, you know what? We need to record these chats and share them with the world. Podcasting is so easy and yet so hard. (laughs) The easy part is just the logistics, right? You can hire someone to do the editing. You can hire someone to do all the back behind the scenes. You could publish it out. Anybody can put a podcast out. Truly, truly, anybody can put a podcast out. But the hard part is like, okay, like, what are we going to say that makes sense for you, the listener, and also is something that we're passionate about. And we're not just pulling shit out of our ass just to have a podcast show because that is not what I want. And I felt like throughout my podcast, because it's gone through some changes. So it went from just me and Dee to then just me and to me and a, a few other ladies. And then um, me and my husband. And now it is where it is today, which I'm going to explain. But there were definitely times where I felt like I was just trying to put a show out and that is not who I am and that's not what I wanted the podcast to be. So there was definitely a lot of shows that have been put out over the years that are just really not, they just don't resonate with me as much as maybe I would normally want them to or uh, they're just fillers. If I'm being quite honest with you, I'm, I'm really just sharing my heart here. Or I would just go months and months without doing anything because I just was not motivated And one of the things my husband and I have really been talking about and working on lately is narrowing our focus. Really, it's probably me more so than him. Although a few times this last year, Nathan has definitely wanted to go off on some tangents that I'm like, no, that's not what you do. (laughs) You do this. And now I'm having that conversation with myself. Like, Shannon, what do you do? Like, what is your passion? What do you do? I host amazing retreats. I have amazing online courses, totally tooting my own horn here. Uh, And I help other people host retreats. And I own a retreat center. There's a theme here, right? Retreat, retreat, retreat. Um, Even my online courses have a lot of of retreat uh, content in there. So shouldn't that be what my podcast is about? (laughs) Okay, light bulb. Anyway, yes, do I have amazing conversations with humans that I think are just super powerful or thought-provoking? Absolutely. Especially at my retreats, we do those conversations, lots of deep conversations, and I love that. And I love sharing who I've shared on this podcast. But recently, I've been bringing on a lot of hosts who host retreats, and I've just been diving really deep. Obviously, I just wrote my Retreat Leaders Playbook book, and I've been getting even deeper into my online course for retreat hosts. And I've just noticed the podcast has like sparked more interest for me. Like I'm like excited to record with a host or I'm excited to put some information together for you. So all that to be said, my business is retreats. That is my primary business. So that is probably what this show should be about. (laughs) And if you're listening and you're like, man, that's not what I like about you, Shannon, in this show. I like listening to some of the thought provoking conversations that have happened on the show throughout the years then I'm super, super sorry to change the game on you. Um, But I feel like I need to be true to my heart, to who I am, to what I do, to what we do. And yes, Nathan will still be a guest and I'm probably going to have some tangents here and there just because maybe they're super strong on my heart, but I'm not just going to have time fillers and I'm not just going to throw a show out there. Uh, I really want to make sure that I am focusing on what I'm passionate about. And I am passionate. I am really passionate about people hosting transformational retreats. Uh, especially that passion was really, really fired up even more so. I feel like it was already on fire, but it really just like skyrocketed during COVID uh, when it just was so plainly obvious to myself and probably all of you and everybody else in the world that we don't take good enough care of ourselves and we need the space to do that. And it's not in our everyday lives. Yes, you can absolutely make changes. Yes, you can see a therapist. Yes, you can work with a coach. Yes, you can do all these things. And absolutely, you can make incremental changes each day. But to truly transform in a short period of time, a retreat space is where it's at. I cannot even begin to tell you 
what we have seen here at the ranch and even at all my retreats all around the world. The transformation, the reset, the reboot, the release is just phenomenal. And so I just wanted to share with you that that's where this podcast is going. I've always been a big fan of saying I write my life in pencil so that I can change and adapt. And that's what I feel like I've done with the podcast. I've started off with what I was passionate about, moved into other things, and now I'm here again with what I'm super passionate about. And that is sharing things about retreats, sharing other hosts and their stories, uh, sharing business practices, sharing things that you shouldn't do, um, just all kinds of things that has to do with retreats. And so I'm invite you to come along with me if this sounds like something for you. If it doesn't, but you know someone who might, please share this podcast with them. I would really love that. And really just thank you. If there's one person listening to this show, thank you. <laughs> if there's one million people, thank you. Uh, I just really appreciate it. And I appreciate you giving me this space, this platform to share what I'm passionate about and um, hopefully to help other people get passionate about it too. So thanks everyone, and I hope you will join us along this journey.